Hello again, I'm Mike Mazzalongo and you're watching the Bible Talk video blog. Today's blog entry is entitled, Planning for Death. Well, the news of the passing of famous people reminds us that in the end, we all must die, even celebrities. For any loss, there is a time for grieving. This grieving, however, will only be complete when we accept that another's death points to our own inevitable end. This realization should motivate us to plan for that sure event. Now planning for our death means we have accepted the reality of it and are ready to go on living despite this hard truth. Our planning therefore should include instructions for the disposal of our bodies and possessions. In addition to this, we should also begin to say and do those things we would do if we knew there were only a few days left to live. Patching up relationships, writing a letter of love, going on that hot air balloon ride, really living is the best way to prepare for dying. Finally, we need to remember that a careful examination of our relationship with God is a must. The first person we will see after death is Christ, Hebrews 9 verse 27. And so guaranteeing that our hearts are right with Him is the surest way to approach death with peace and comfort. Planning for our deaths in these ways will guarantee that we live fulfilling lives and assure that our deaths will be a stepping stone to eternal life. And I'm sure that we all want that wonderful gift. Well, I'm Mike Mazzalongo and this is the Bible Talk video blog. Hope you'll be back to visit with us soon. Bye-bye.